That was jokes, man. With Ging and Bert. <laughs> Doing that whole thing with the time and all that. That was bare funny, man, on the weekend. You should have been there because it was bloody hilarious. I never thought something as simple as that would create something as funny as that with Bert doing that <laughs> while it's recording as well. You know what I mean? Not even pausing it and doing it, just blah, blah, blah. And it's still recording. <laughs> it was just brilliant, proper funny, really, really funny stuff. It's 11 o'clock now. Probably going to end up going that today. Do some shopping. We need some stuff. Like bread, meat. Not much really, but certain things we need. Because it's Tuesday. It's Tuesday today. Tuesday. Very Tuesday. Very Tuesday today to be. Half past three. Quarter to seven. Twenty past eight. Cheesecake. Lovely stuff. Hello people. It's twenty to twelve now. It's still Tuesday. But then you probably already knew that. I am watching Dawn of the Dead. Not the original, mind you. The remake. 2004's remake. With Ring Rhymes in it. It's a good film, man. It's a good remake. Whether you're a friend in real life or you're just watching on YouTube, it doesn't really bother me if you if you like me or not. I don't really care, to be fair with you. Obviously it's better if you do like me, because then, you know, you can tell your friends who can tell their friends, so on and so forth. But at the end of the day, it doesn't really matter to me. I only do this for my own entertainment, and it gives me something to do. Okay, I will tell you this story. On the Friday just gone, which was the 1st, or the 31st of October, November. It was only this Friday just gone. And Vito ate something dodgy, and he had some dodgy shits in the fucking kitchen, which is literally um, six feet away from the fucking front room. And the night before that, Ginge was there and so was Grant and either one of them well I'm pretty sure Grant was there um, but I know Ginge was definitely there and the fact that he didn't even smell it you know says to me that you either you couldn't do it because you'd, you'd get too queasy and probably be sick like I nearly was when I had to do it because there was no way I was sitting there all fucking day with that smell and just the fact that you know that the shit like literally six seven feet away from you there ain't no way I'm sitting in that situation without clearing it up first and that's the other thing you know when you do stuff like that really rank stuff that people don't really want to do but they do it because they kind of have to do it I didn't want to do it I didn't, didn't want to do that at all but I had to do it because there's no way he could have done it on his own it's all good though I'm missing my film. Not that that really mattered anyway, because I just missed that bloody film. Not because I didn't want to watch it, but because my signal was so crap. <clears throat> because I haven't got my own signal in this room. You can't beat them, fucking join them. Then most people get more confused than you ever thought they would do. <laughs> so easy, it's... Well, yeah, that's it. it is really easy sometimes, but there you go. Most of the time, I know I'm fucking about anyway, so it don't matter. I think they actually get my personality finally, so. It's called a blank expression. It's one thirty, by the way. I wasn't meant to tell you that, but I forgot to check the time. Going to bed soon. I'm quite tired. This will be interesting watching this back. In a lot of ways. It'll be me, then Bert. Probably watching this. Ginge might be there. Hello, Ginge, if you're there. Someone else might be there. I don't know. Probably just me, me and Bert, more than likely. Because it's just. That's the stuff we do together, man. This is what we do together. <laughs> not what I'm doing right now, but making videos and uploading them. That's what me and Bert do. So, by the way, Bert to you people is the Vito 28. Go on this channel, it's good. Check it out, it's got some good stuff on there. It's probably better than my channel, to be fair. But there you go, I'm quite, um, what's the word? Honest? Is that the right word? There is another word I'm looking for, but I can't quite find it. Yeah. 
his video probably is better than mine, but my, my, my channel's got some pretty cool stuff on it as well. As you people know that are watching this, who I've shared this with, you people, well, some of you, most of you have probably watched some of my videos, some of you haven't, and a lot of you have probably not seen some of my videos. You should just go around my channel and watch the Rage videos, because they're the best ones on my channel without a doubt. The Rage laughing videos are the best. Just a beautiful lie. Haha, <laughs> was it a lie or wasn't it? Ha ha, ha 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 ha. There's only one way to find out about a lot of things. Not just what I just said, about a lot of things I'll talk about. But most of it is the truth. Most of it is from my own head. Most of it is genuine. Most of it, I believe in what I say. I don't just say it. I feel what I say. 29 minutes left on this tape. slightly mad by the way well maybe just bored I don't know either way make a choice take your pick just a beautiful lie Shakira Shakira Beyonce Beyonce just a beautiful lie I know I can't sing I understand that I'm not trying to sing if I was, I would make a video of me just singing, wouldn't I? It's a sign of happiness, apparently, singing. Maybe I am happy. Yes. It's hard to not look at that screen, man. There's a lot of you people know. When you got that screen out, whether it's on your camera, or whether it's on your computer, it's very hard not to look at that screen and just to focus all your energy on that little black hole. It's very hard indeed. <laughs> it's too distracting, because it's only there, and you're like, ah, oh, keep looking at it, keep looking at it, keep looking at it, keep looking at it, keep looking at it. <laughs> It's just like too much of a distraction because there's something there and you want to watch it like it's weird man it's, you know you're going to watch it back anyway but it's just proper weird anyway I'll see you tomorrow yeah I well, know it's 3am and I am definitely going to bed after this one I'm surprised I'm still up to be fair it's up fairly early it's like 9 o'clock in the morning 8 o'clock in the morning I was up so I feel really tired it's amazing that nothing beats your own bed am I the only one that thinks so? probably not but there's probably loads of you people that think that you can't beat your own bed man nothing beats that for comfort anyway even a new bed takes a while to make like the Simpsons when <laughs> You know, Homer gets a new sofa and he's going, oh, it's going to take me years to make this ass groove again, or whatever he says. The lamb was, it took me years to form this ass groove. What do the Americans say? Ass. I ain't nothing against the Americans. America's all good. If it weren't for them, in a lot of ways, we probably wouldn't. <laughs> if it wasn't for them, you know, would England exist without America's help? Because originally they didn't want to help us. They want they didn't want nothing to do with the war. There you go. That's something a lot of people might not know. But then most people do know that. It's kind of common knowledge. But then there might be people that watch this that don't know that. I don't know. People that want to learn about my culture, so to speak. But then obviously, most American people will know that, and most English people will know that. Are any of us 100% English, or 100% American, or whatever, whatever country you come from, whatever nationality you are, are any of us 100% our nationality? I don't think so. No way. Fuck off. Bear cold. What do you think then about anything, about what I've spoke about? Do you agree with me? A lot of you won't know whether to agree or not about certain things. But certain things you will be able to agree on or certain things you'll be able to dis disagree on. It's totally your choice. I don't mind. I'm open to anything. I wonder how many people have got a problem with Hogan joining TNA. If you're an old WWF fan. 
how many of you, how many of you people, how many of you wrestling fans have got a problem with that? The fact that he didn't go back to WWE, it's because he knows it's going to be shit. And it is shit anyway. That's why he's gone to TNA. And he'll have more control over TNA than he will WWE. That's why he's gone to TNA. But at the end of the day, TNA will be more respected, it will be bigger than WWE in 10 years time. Without a doubt. Mark my words, when WCW failed, TNA will succeed. It's got the talent.